Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. It's Masha and in today's video we'll be talking about spring summer 2020 fashion trends and how to wear them in real life. So if you are interested in 12 or maybe 10 fashion trends for the spring summer 2020 then stay with me and let's get started. The spring summer 2020 doesn't seem like a big change to me and designers instead they keep uh, getting their inspiration from fall winter and new collections they seem like the continuation of fall winter collections and those trends instead of the something new and something fresh but in general the first major trend of the entire spring summer season for 2020 is 70s and the 70s brings those voluminous shoulders, boxy silhouettes, as well as boyish silhouettes and those suits from 70s, they look uh, long and lean. I was still highlighting the waist, there are lots of turtlenecks, shirts, as well as slightly flared trousers. And the first trend is continuation of 70s is shirts with pointed disco color you know those shirts especially i love the white ones with the pointed uh, color that look amazing and we saw some of these triangular colors at paco Rabanne, paired with wild disco outfits with all kinds of colorful garments at louis vuitton the disco color was paired with 70s silhouettes but the patterns and colors felt a little more dated and a little like circus uh, even the disco colors at Fendi were added to lots of different types of coats and jackets included a cushioned shirt and long jackets trench coats and how to wear this trend in real life wear disco color blouses under leather uh, trench coat or some leather jacket like shown by Paco Rabanne get that inspiration from Paco Rabanne because I think this is the best thing and uh, paired with some blue jeans or maybe dark uh, denim will go amazing too and speaking of denim the second trend of this spring summer 2020 is denim especially blue denim and you ask me why blue denim maybe because of the Pantone color of 2020 is classic blue that's why I'm not sure but that's my guess and the 70s revival is only getting stronger and stronger this spring collection presented lots of blue jeans from Bermuda shorts at Chanel to 70s kick flares at Celine and upcycled grunge numbers at Givenchy and for ladies who love their dresses wear this trend in form of mini denim dress paired with the platform heels and big curly hair which is one more trend of this spring summer 2020 if you didn't watch my video about hair trends i will link it below maybe guys you're curious to watch it and to continue that trend i found one interesting dress on top shop and i really like it because of the color and i think it will look amazing paired with um, platform heels and wavy hair and if you really like the denim on denim look then there is one more option to wear this trend in spring summer 2020 uh, you can check out the Bottega Veneta minimals dark indigo pairing as well as Balenciaga's uh, two-piece and where designers in these two outfits they were matching exactly same shade of the denim which means that you can match the top or blazer or whatever jacket the denim jacket with your pants Pants, which is kind of similar shade or maybe exactly similar shade and it will look trendy like a one-piece outfit and the fashion trend number three is flowy dresses of course it's great to have flowy dresses for spring summer season because we all want to go and embrace the warm weather and if you love white color which is perfect for spring summer then you have to try this trend because designers presented lots of dresses on the catwalk the dress silhouettes at Valentina of the draped dresses this year were slightly pinched at the waist to flatter for a more casual twist check out this flowy sundresses at Carolina Strada which were covered with prints and how to wear this trend in real life you can wear your long line white dress with belt 
maybe brown maybe black and matching sandals like shown by Alexander McQueen here or you can opt for a total white outfit with the platform sandals spiced up by silver accessories like earrings or maybe bag like shown by Miu Miu also I wanted to show you one dress because let's just admire this dress because it looks like a masterpiece like an art to me and the fashion trend number four within dresses still because dress is the uniform for spring summer is tropical printed dresses and yes it's all about that J Lo's iconic dress which broke the internet in 2000s and I'm pretty sure you guys already seen that she was closing the Versace spring summer 2020 collection in this uh, gorgeous tropical printed beauty Tropical print was seen everywhere, Dolce & Gabbana, Fendi, Marnie, Valentino, lending the new life to new summer florals. And those florals are very juicy, very dark at the same time, showing those, those tropical uh, leaves and uh, everything mixed up. I've seen some dresses which are not in this kind of print, which are in a different color, like white, maybe even some of them they had pink in it like remember four years ago it was uh, very trendy to mix up tropical print with pink color especially stripes how to wear this trend of course you can get the chiffon dress not as long as was shown on Dolce & Gabbana or Fendi or somewhere else but you can get the knee length so just imagine that you have a chiffon dress in this beautiful print which is knee length and maybe a little bit like flowy and you can com complete this dress with hoop earrings, a chain, a gold chain, necklace like a choker or something similar to that and you can wear some matching scarf on your head too which is super trendy and one more hair trend of 2020 for spring summer season two so that was um, kind of inspiration that I got from Dolce & Gabbana's collection and I really love it and I really enjoy it. One more way to wear this beautiful trend is in the form of the suit like shown by Fendi. It looks so stylish and uh, summer at the same time so you can wear the suit with some black cami or white cami whatever you prefer or maybe even some uh, heels on top and if you are not ready for the crazy bright color then you can opt for black and white option I found one beautiful shirt in this black and white tropical suit and it goes the print goes only from one side so you can pair this shirt with your black uh, pants or maybe with the leather pants like shown on this picture I will link this shirt down below too so maybe you guys can check it out and the fashion trend number five you guys is hot pants so when i say hot i mean hot so they are super super short and their shirt like look like panties to me and if you are brave enough then you can wear this trend and you can pair it with some simple uh, white t-shirt or even some flowy blouse will go amazing too one of the unique ways to show this uh, super short shirts we're seen at Salvador Ferragama runways where they were made of leather from the point of wearing this kind of pants panties shirts then i think it's not really good for summer because it's hot and wearing leather during summer is not a good idea i think but it looks amazing it looks of course like fashion kind of stuff but for spring uh, for summer i would opt for if you want to go with this trend i would go for something lightweight and maybe even denim shirts will go nice or some kind of flowy shirts made of silk or which looks like panties yeah i'm not sure how to wear this trend but let's find out guys there's still a little tiny chance to wear this trend on the street because chanel styled this look with the black tights so you can opt for sheer tights or maybe even for uh, black like not transparent tights and uh, wear this kind of look for spring with the uh, overknit boots maybe with the uh, 
some leather biker jacket will go nice opt for black color uh, panties those shirts and maybe you guys have better idea how to wear this trend leave me the comment below and i'll try it too at Saint Laurent, clubby shorts were paired with sleek smoking jackets and this interesting combination made the shirts feel all the sexier. Other runways uh, give us some fine shirts including Isabel Morand, Alexander Wang, Brandon Maxwell and Hermes. And how to wear this trend in real life? Some ideas how to wear this trend is to balance the look out with some oversized or long sleeved jackets like a biker jacket maybe I would wear do not wear it with a trench coat because it doesn't look good on the street style. It does look good on runways, maybe, but not on the street. Like at Chanel, you can style them with uh, tights or stockings and wear them with flats. But if the thought of it, hot pants, makes you want to run, then Bermudas are here to save your day. So the next trend number six is Bermuda shorts. And I think this is one of the trends I'm really excited about for this spring summer. 2020 because the length of the shorts makes them appropriate for work and uh, it will solve the problem for uh, freezing offices as well as for super hot offices when it's hot outside and uh, you still need to look appropriate for office then you can opt for those bermuda shorts designers from bottega veneta to chloe to Givenchy embrace the bermuda short suits for spring putting a twist on the classic suit. Tom Ford offered a more playful take on Bermuda suit opting for a hot pink mismatched fabric. On the catwalks, most of them were worn with flat sliders or heels for the elevated look. These looks totally remind me of Julia Roberts wearing this iconic Bermuda suit in the movie Pretty Woman and she looked gorgeous. However, be careful with this trend since they can make you look shorter because the length of Bermudas, they cut you in half. And to prevent this from happening, you can opt for flats or the kitten heel will look nice with Bermudas. And I filmed the video how to wear Bermudas. I will link it below too, guys. So if you're curious on how to look great in this uh, interesting trend, then you can check out my video below. And I found some interesting one from Pretty Little Thing, which is cute blazer and shorts in this elegant stone color. But if you want some designer option, then there is one amazing double-breasted blazer and bermudas from Frankie's shop in beautiful army green color. Also, I think this Forever 21 bermudas paired with biker jacket and heeled sandals looks good for every day. And how to wear Bermuda shorts. This spring summer 2020, wear Bermuda short suits in all possible colors from hot pink to this elegant beige and stone colors. Wear Bermudas like Julia Roberts did in Pretty Woman, paired with white flowy blouse tucked in from the front and with a little nice belt. And the fashion trend number seven is those 70s inspired trench coats. It means that they'll have luminous shoulders, long line silhouette, and most of them are shown in earthy colors such as sand, stone, or mm, this beautiful caramel color, which makes this trench coat classy and uh, it can make a nice addition to your basics. But this season they also come in fresh colors, silver one and spearmint in Balenciaga. How to wear this trend? For the casual look, you can wear it with a white shirt paired with the blue jeans and this trench coat over um, your outfit. Or you can wear it over your Bermuda short suit with white sneakers like shown by Paul Smith. And we are moving from those earthy tones to the next trend, number eight which is neon colors again so you guys that's why i'm wearing this bright neon color blouse today hmm. bright color neon is not a new trend neon has been present for a while now and i think for already a couple of seasons for sure however this year wear your neon 
with neon and there are lots of interesting color combinations unexpected color pairings like orange and pink blue and green were super refreshing and super interesting and i'm so excited to see at morning uh, there were also looks like dresses with mixed color palettes like pink and yellow uh, for example at gucci at Valentina we've seen the striking neon green maxi dress which is adorable. How to wear this trend in real life. Wear your neon shirts with the neon blouses which is like pink and orange, green and blue, like very bright colors. I like neon in general and not everybody loves neon because it's bright, it's bold. But I like this total blue look from Boss or this hot pink outfit from Kosha looks also amazing. But if you want to play with this trend then you can always opt for neon accessories and from neon we are moving to the next trend number nine which is crochet fabric and the crochet of course is not going anywhere for spring summer and especially for summer because it's always here and designers they're just saying that it's a trend but it's been like classic to me you can look at this jonathan simka's crochet blue dress in this beautiful blue dress and sweater combination to marnie's all over floral crochet gown as seen at Jonathan Simkai, Fendi, Salvador Ferragamo, Gabriela Hurst. Keeping cool won't be an issue in spring summer 2020 thanks to crochet. You'll find this fabric is still in style for next season with even better design. I found a couple dresses for you guys that I really really like. So I found this beautiful crochet dress from Skin. They have this dress in two colors, navy and beige. It's a perfect piece for layering over a neutral sleep or bikini or this sleet dress from hot miami styles looks amazing it's one of my favorite from them and i think i already shown it in my previous video maybe for winter fall 2019 nah it could be no it can be because it's it was cold crochet was not there yet yeah anyway i was showing that already and it's beautiful but if you want to go for something a little bit shorter for this summer then i found this beautiful play suit on aces in stunning rose gold color or this bodycon dress in mini length how to wear crochet on the street in real life since crochet in most cases well in all cases is see-through then i would wear a sweater with some cami underneath which is matching color for example if you're wearing white crochet uh, sweater then opt for a white cami and if you're wearing black then wear black underneath and just pair it with simple um, blue jeans or black uh, jeans will go nice too for that kind of boho vibe maybe you can even braid your hair for that too it will look nice or you can wear your crochet dress uh, to the beach. It's always a good idea because it's not hot. It's, it's good. <laughs> and the fashion trend number 10 is uh, polka dots. I decided to include that one and just to share with you guys. But to me, polka dots is classic and it's not even the trend. Uh, it was seen on from Gucci to Carolina Herrera to Marc Jacobs to Balenciaga. Designers were using lots of polka dots and I think it was trendy for 2018 and for 2019 for spring summer. Um, I'm gonna check it out but for spring summer 2018 it was definitely it was definitely there and it's trendy in all different kind of shapes you can opt for a mini dress a maxi dress maxi skirt um, tailored pants in the polka dot and or even a suit will go amazing too polka dot looks extremely feminine and elegant no matter what and how you pair it you can wear it as a dress or you can even add some uh, hat like this in polka dots or you can even opt for a skirt it will look super super feminine, girlish, elegant. For spring summer, I would go for a dress and I found some beautiful dresses for you guys. So I personally love the black and white print because it looks classic, but I also found this maxi dress in orange color from Aces. I hope they still have it. You can wear it with the white sneakers. These ruffles, they make the look even more feminine. 
I hope you found this spring summer 2020 fashion trends video helpful and let me know how you go into where your fashion trends for spring summer 2020 in real life in the comments below right there um, so curious to know because maybe I didn't cover something don't forget to subscribe and I love you guys so much I'll see you in my next videos bye